Something officials reveal they have decoded transmissions from 3i Atlas. What it says might change everything. In 2025, astronomical networks detected our solar system's third confirmed interstellar visitor, designated 3i Atlas. This cosmic object immediately defied every known classification. Unlike previous visitors that tumbled chaotically through space, 3i Atlas exhibited controlled flight patterns and executed deliberate course corrections. Its massive 700,000-kilometer coma, half our sun's diameter, pulsed with electromagnetic signals every seven seconds. As it carved through our asteroid belt with surgical precision, one chilling question emerged. What if this object wasn't exploring but reporting back? When physics stopped making sense, 3i Atlas shattered every assumption about interstellar visitors from the moment it appeared in our detection systems. Most objects from beyond our solar system follow chaotic, unpredictable trajectories. They barrel through space at wild angles before disappearing forever into the cosmic void. But 3i Atlas demonstrated something entirely different, surgical precision that defied natural explanation. The object's trajectory showed an eerie smoothness that challenged decades of astronomical understanding. Its path allowed it to drift past several planets in ways that maximized gravitational efficiency as though it had somehow mapped our entire solar system long before arriving. When astronomers traced its origin path backwards, they discovered something statistically impossible without intelligent intervention. This wasn't a random space rock wandering through the cosmos. The path of 3i Atlas required navigating through debris fields, solar radiation spikes and planetary collision zones with mathematical elegance. It moved like a chess piece on a cosmic board, avoiding every threat with precision that suggested advanced planning or real-time control. The object demonstrated what scientists described as piloted behavior, a term that sent shockwaves through the astronomical community. What made this discovery truly unsettling was the impossibility of such precision occurring naturally. Rogue bodies from interstellar space simply don't possess the capability to execute such calculated maneuvers. They lack propulsion systems, guidance mechanisms, or any form of intelligent control. Yet 3i Atlas moved as if it knew exactly where it was going, executing course adjustments with a precision that would be impressive even for our most advanced spacecraft. The implications were staggering. Either we were witnessing an extraordinary cosmic coincidence or something had deliberately guided this object into our solar system. When NASA pointed the James Webb Space Telescope toward 3i Atlas, the results challenged decades of astronomical understanding and left even the most skeptical researchers speechless. The thermal readings alone defied every known principle governing natural space objects. Unlike comets or asteroids that emit heat in random bursts as ice sublimates and surface materials react to solar radiation, 3i Atlas showed consistent rhythmic heat emission patterns. These weren't chaotic thermal signatures typical of natural objects. The heat patterns pulsed with measured precision, almost like engineered signals being transmitted across space. Webb's advanced spectrography capabilities revealed materials never before seen in any known interstellar object. Hyper-reflective compounds that appeared possibly artificial and dense internal structuring that suggested hollow segments within the object. But the most disturbing discovery was a faint recurring electromagnetic anomaly echoing from within 3i Atlas. This low bandwidth frequency repeated every 147 seconds, matching the exact signature of a known pulsar. The critical problem was obvious to any physicist. The object had no internal energy source, no spinning core, and no magnetic field capable of generating such a signal. The object appeared to be mimicking something it had encountered or actively, communicating with something beyond our detection, capabilities, Webb's infrared analysis revealed structural patterns that resembled recursive geometric fractals, patterns known to emerge in complex systems like brain tissue and quantum processes. Some researchers theorized this might be what they called a consciousness engine, a system designed not just to survive space travel, but to think and evolve while moving through star systems. The implications were terrifying. We might be facing not just alien technology, but a learning entity that becomes smarter with each observation. Two visitors, one terrifying pattern. The mystery deepened significantly. A fast-moving object the size of Manhattan is hurtling towards our solar system 
and it will make its closest pass to Earth on December 17th. Comet? Asteroid or something else? A Harvard astrophysicist believes there's a strong likelihood this is a craft of alien origin, and the implications for humanity would be profound. It may not be a rock. It is called 3i Atlas. Give me the best case for why you think this object may be extraterrestrial and maybe alien form. Well, first, its brightness implies that if it represents reflection of sunlight from a solid object, it needs to be 20 kilometers in diameter. That's bigger than Manhattan Island, and this is a giant rock. The previous interstellar objects were hundreds of times smaller, so it just doesn't make sense that the third object from interstellar space would be 100 times bigger than the previous two, and we wouldn't see anything in between. And if you look at the trajectory of this object, indeed it's perfectly aligned with the plane of the planets around the Sun. Fundamental question is, was this designed by intelligence out there? When researchers cross-referenced 3i Atlas's electromagnetic signature with archive data from Oumuamua, our first confirmed interstellar visitor, the comparison revealed something that sent shockwaves through the scientific community. The exact same 47 frequency had been detected briefly in Oumuamua's tail just before it left our solar system. The crucial difference was that 3i Atlas's signal was significantly louder and more sustained. This discovery completely reframed our understanding of both objects. Oumuamua had puzzled scientists with its unusual cigar shape, strange tumbling motion, and an unexplained acceleration that couldn't be accounted for by gravitational models alone. Some experts had argued it represented alien technology, while others insisted it was simply an unusual natural phenomenon. The debate remained unresolved because Oumuamua disappeared before comprehensive studies could be completed. But now with 3i Atlas displaying similar but more advanced characteristics, a disturbing pattern emerged. The evidence suggested that Oumuamua may have been a reconnaissance probe, a passive device sent to assess our planet and technological capabilities. If this theory held merit, then 3i Atlas represented something far more significant, not passive observation, but active engagement, the difference between a radar ping and a fully operational surveillance system. Some researchers theorize that Oumuamua was the lock, a silent, inert object designed to passively assess Earth's readiness, intelligence and reaction. 3i Atlas was the key, designed not just to observe but to unlock something, whether buried within our planet, encoded in our species, or awaiting activation in orbit. The synchronized electromagnetic signatures suggested a coordinated system spanning years and potentially multiple star systems. Just when scientists believed they had mapped 3i Atlas's future trajectory, the object performed a maneuver that shattered every assumption about its nature. Telescopes in Chile and Hawaii recorded a subtle but unmistakable course shift that couldn't be explained by gravity, solar wind, or any known natural force. This wasn't the random drift typical of comets or the predictable orbital mechanics of asteroids. The object veered slightly off its projected arc, aligning instead with a completely new vector that brought it closer to Earth's orbital plane. To mission analysts at NASA's Deep Space Network and space agencies worldwide, the implications were alarming. The timing and precision of this maneuver implied conscious decision-making. Something had responded either to our presence or to external commands we couldn't detect. This course correction was surgical in its precision and deliberate in its execution. The word decision sparked emergency meetings at NASA, ESA, and private research institutions worldwide. If Oumuamua had been a passive observer, then 3i Atlas was clearly something more active, something that was not only monitoring us, but potentially maneuvering in response to what it observed. The maneuver occurred precisely when James Webb had achieved optimal tracking position, suggesting the object was aware of our surveillance efforts. This timing couldn't be dismissed as coincidence. The course correction demonstrated technological capabilities far beyond current human understanding. The ability to execute precise orbital adjustments without visible propulsion systems or energy sources. The object appeared to be operating under intelligent control, responding to stimuli and adjusting its behavior accordingly. This transformed 3i Atlas from an astronomical curiosity into potential confirmation of technologies that challenged our understanding of what's possible in the universe.